Hello movie lovers. It's great to see you here. Don't forget to subscribe to catch my daily movie recommendations. Let's dive into the world of cinema together. Number 10. Jennifer 8. Jennifer 8 is a 1992 psychological thriller film directed by Bruce Robinson. The film follows John Berlin, a burned-out police detective who is sent to a small California town to investigate a string of murders. While there, he becomes obsessed with a blind woman named Helena, who may be the next victim of the killer. As John investigates the murders and tries to protect Helena, he becomes increasingly convinced that the killer may be someone close to him. Number 9 Henry and June Henry and June is a 1990 biographical drama film directed by Philip Kaufman, which explores the love triangle between writer Henry Miller, his wife June, and Annas Nien in 1930s Paris. The film follows the complex and sometimes scandalous relationships between the three characters as they navigate their artistic passions and desires. The film features strong performances by Fred Ward as Henry Miller, Uma Thurman as June, and Maria de Medeiros as Annas Nien. Henry and June was the first film to receive an NC-17 rating upon its release, due to its explicit sexual content. Number 8 Vittel Vittel is a historical drama film set in 1671 France, directed by Roland Joff. It is based on the true story of Francois Vittel, a skilled and talented chef who was tasked with orchestrating a three-day feast for the King Louis XIV. Vittel is played by Girard Depardieu, who portrays him as a hard-working and dedicated chef who is passionate about his craft. As Vittel struggles to prepare the lavish meal and entertain the guests, he falls in love with Andy Montausier, played by Uma Thurman, who is a member of the court. The film explores the complicated relationships between the nobility and the servants, as well as the pressure and expectations placed on Vittel to succeed in his monumental task. Number 7 Beautiful Girls Beautiful Girls is a 1996 American romantic comedy drama film directed by Ted Dem and starring Matt Dillon. Natalie Portman, and Uma Thurman. The story follows Willie Conway, a piano player who returns to his hometown for his high school reunion and starts to question his life choices as he reconnects with his old friends and meets a young girl named Marty, who makes him question his engagement to his girlfriend back in New York City. The film explores themes of relationships, love, and growing up. Nubmer 6 Tape Tape is a 2001 independent drama film directed by Richard Linklater and starring Ethan Hawke, Robert Sean, Leonard, and Uma Thurman. The film takes place entirely in a motel room where two old friends, Vince and John, reunite and have a conversation about a past event that affected their lives. As the night goes on, their discussion becomes increasingly intense and reveals hidden truths about their friendship and past actions. The arrival of a woman named Amy further complicates the situation and leads to a dramatic climax. Tape is known for its minimalist approach, intense dialogue, and strong performances from its cast. Number 5 Sweet and Lowdown Sweet and Lowdown is a 1999 comedy drama film written and directed by Woody Allen. The movie is set in the 1930s and follows the story of Emmett Ray played by Sean Penn a talented yet eccentric jazz guitarist. Emmett Ray is considered one of the best jazz guitarists of his time, but his personal life is a mess. He is a womanizer, a drunk, and a petty thief. Emmett's life takes a new turn when he falls in love with Hattie, the mute laundress. Despite his flaws, Hattie sees the good in Emmett and tries to help him become a better person. The film explores the relationship between the two characters and the challenges they face as they navigate through their complicated lives. Number 4 Les Miserables The 1998 film adaptation of the classic novel Les Miserables by Victor Hugo follows the story of Jean Valjean, a former convict who seeks redemption in 19th century France. After breaking his parole, Valjean is relentlessly pursued by the ruthless police inspector Javert. Along the way, Valjean encounters Fantine, a factory worker who is forced into prostitution to support her daughter Cassette. Valjean takes it upon himself to care for Cassette, and they form a deep bond as they try to evade Javert's pursuit. Number 3. Gataka Gataka is a science fiction film set in a future where genetic engineering has become the norm 
creating a society that discriminates against, invalids, people who are born naturally without any genetic alterations. The story follows Vincent Freeman, an invalid who dreams of becoming an astronaut, but is limited by his genetic makeup. He assumes the identity of a genetically superior individual named Jerome Morrow in order to pursue his dream. But his plan is threatened when a director at the Gataka Aerospace Corporation is murdered and his DNA is found at the scene. As the investigation intensifies, Vincent must avoid detection and find a way to prove his innocence, while also dealing with his growing feelings for a co-worker named Irene. Number 2 Kill Bill Volume 1. Kill Bill, Vol. 1, is a 2003 action film directed by Quentin Tarantino. The movie tells the story of The Bride, a former member of an assassination team who wakes up from a four-year coma to seek revenge on her former colleagues who betrayed her on her wedding day. The Bride, played by Uma Thurman, embarks on a bloody quest to track down and kill her enemies, including her former boss Bill, played by David Carradine. Along the way, she battles various skilled assassins, including the infamous Crazy 88, in a series of epic and violent fight scenes. The film is known for its stylish visuals, eclectic soundtrack, and its homage to classic martial arts and exploitation films. Number 1 Pulp Fiction Pulp Fiction is a crime drama film directed by Quentin Tarantino and released in 1994. The film tells four interlocking stories that involve hitmen, a boxer, a gangster's wife, and a pair of armed robbers. The film features an ensemble cast, including John Travolta, Uma Thurman, Samuel L. Jackson, Harvey Keitel, and Bruce Willis. The nonlinear narrative structure of the film, along with its sharp dialogue, pop culture references, and eclectic soundtrack, made it a critical and commercial success. Pulp Fiction received numerous awards and nominations, including seven Oscar nominations and one win for Best Original Screenplay.